Welcome back to this DC Universe Online Let's Play. This is Sambo with Blaze Purple, and if you have been watching our previous episodes, you know we left off the last one, um, having started our uh, guided tour through the Watchtower, the Watchtower of Major Hugeness, um, as you can see. So, let's get right into it. No need for introductions. We'll carry right on from where we left off. So we're now trying to find the reactor core. So I'm sure that much hilarity will ensue as I get myself lost trying to find it. So let's see, we went down earlier. So I imagine we have to go back up. And the warp core. I'm going to have to bring up the map. Okay, so you can see it's right below us. But we are, in fact, going to have to go around. Let me... Let me zoom out. Let me zoom out. We are going to have to go round one of these side wings. So uh, let's do that. As I said in the last video, I mean, I do appreciate really cool design, and as you can see, I mean, look at that. That's just awesome. Awesome looking. Um, differently themed and styled rooms, and you know, a, a huge sense of scale. I mean, this really really is a massive um, area but at the end of the day you know what it's just actually a pain in the butt after you've seen it the first time um, to get around to be frank anyway oh hello guess who this is that's right it's Batgirl and she clearly sells this awesome looking piece of equipment that that is really that's a really nice set actually let's have a look See what requirements this gift that takes. Be bought. It must be earned. Must be Bring earned. Proof that you are a champion, and we will begin. Thank you, Betty. All right. Um. So, it requires tech. Um. It requires obviously whether you're a controller or a healer, and it requires level 30. Let's have a look and see what it looks like on. Yeah, that that is freaking awesome. That's like an actual rocket glider pack all purple and shiny with tech bits yeah that's cool that's very cool very nice this suit cannot be bought oh hush it must thank be you burned. anyway let's carry on oh oh here's robin g'day robin uh-huh that's some sweet armor huh Right, don't know if you yourself, we'll get you hooked up. Recognize that voice, but that's actually Will Wheaton as well, uh, as in Wesley Crusher. Uh, all right, so he's got a whole bunch of stuff actually. Can't wait to be able to level up and uh, presumably grind out some rep, and come back here and pick up some of this stuff. It'll be very cool. All right, back to the map. Where are we? Um, all right, we need to go south. Bit of a look see around. Where are we heading into the deck? Meta deck. Oh, that's right. This is the. Um, oh, I got a, a achievement for exploring the watchtower. This is. Um, what do they call it? Can't remember the. W it's it's some funny wing. Um, now, I'll exit it and enter it again. Aquacultur aquacultural area. There we go. So obviously this is where um, all the green stuff is. Very cool. Ooh, what's that? You know what? I don't know what that is, but I better not use it yet in case it teleports us somewhere or something silly. Um, oh yeah, interesting. Here's basically a hairstylist. So what'll it be today? Looking to change the look? A new do? What'll it be? In other words, the hair uh, barber. Um, I like that. There's a hairstyle called the Hoff. It's got to be an instant purchase, surely. Um, anyway, let's carry on. Let's try not to get distracted. Am I going the right way? No. Of course I'm not, because I'm silly. All right.
This is a very cool looking area. The metal wing. I love it. Look at it. It's all blue and techy and uh, yeah. As I said, annoying to navigate but very cool to look at. We've done some research with Superman over the years. We don't know everything, but we've been able to develop some good stuff. Check it out. I'm very excited about some of Star Lab's new developments. I'm sure you'll see something useful. I'm sure we will. The Justice League Watchtower was specially designed to help heroes meet and get the equipment they need. But it's an unwritten JLA rule that you must gain renown with factions before you can obtain their exclusive gear. Our goal is to create solidarity with the entire hero cause. Lovely. Thank you for that. Um, yeah, God knows where I need to go now. That's the bank. We're looking for a reactor. Oh, look at that. Reactor. Now, this is interesting because on my map, reactor is actually north of us, not south. But anyway, we will go this way. Hmm. Well, I'm definitely in the reactor room. Maybe... Let's see what these are anyway. You're now at the Watchtower Reactor Core. Star Labs and Firestorm rigged it to power the entire Watchtower. If you're looking to immediately take out some villains, you'll find Hawkman and Cyborg here with the latest intel. Well, it's weird. I did locate the reactor core, but it's not updating my quest. Oh well. Um, so more vendors, etc., etc. I wonder why this isn't working and why it says I need to go all the way north. But we'll do it. Oh, for goodness sake. Okay, now it says south. <laughs> it's just doing it to to piss me off. It's, it's deliberate. There's some GM behind the scenes moving my minimap marker deliberately, I think. That is right, yes. <laughs> okay. Okay, this is weird. Here we are. Reactor. That's where I was. Oh, for goodness sake, now it wants me to now it wants me to use that console again. Ah. You're now at the Watchtower Reactor Core. And you Star can't, Labs and Firestorm rigged it. it to power the entire Watchtower. If you're looking to immediately take out some villains, you'll find Hawkman and Cyborg here with the latest intel. All right, now we got to locate the watchtower hangar. Uh, let's find that. I'm thinking a good idea is to check on the map. Alrighty, so we need to go west. Go west. That's right, I can see. Kind of. La di da di da di da di da. We are traversing lots of pretty but unnecessary real estate. That's right. I mean, who knows? Maybe one day in the future they'll absolutely fill all of these halls with hundreds of useful vendors or something. I don't know. Now, let's make sure I'm going the right way. Yes, looks like I possibly am for once. Break out the celebration. All right. No, I'm not. The arrow just mysteriously moved again. Oh my God! What the hell? It's way over there. Oh. Okay. That that time it definitely moved. In fact, I guess with the power of YouTube and being able to rewind once this is finished, we'll be able to be able to prove that maybe. All right. We're looking for. Looking for the hangar.
All right, there's a doorway with the word hanger on it. Ooh, very cool. But hang on, I probably have to go over here and trigger... Trigger something first. All right, there we go. Access the console. The watchtower hangar holds some small portion of the watchtower fleet. The flash is usually here with information on various races rigged all over the world. All right, so I must say there's some pretty cool looking craft in here. Uh, and that looks very much like something Batman would be in. Let's see if we can talk to the Flash, eh? Think fast and go faster. Practice makes perfect, especially when you're perfecting your form. Check out the races I've set up all over Gotham and Metropolis. Get it right and you'll get a reward from me or one of my buddies through email. Why, thank you, Uncle Flash. Or Sheldon Cooper, as I like to call you. All right, where to now? The aquacultural area. Oh, God. Well, we've been there, but does that mean I know where to go? No, it doesn't. So let's follow the marker if it doesn't move around on me. Oh, oh, oh. Collectible. Actually, you know what? I haven't been watching out for them. It's Oracle. That hollow token shows the emblem of the Tech Wing. Tech users use advanced technology and gadgets as their primary tools. These heroes are mentored by Batman. You'll never get a better deal. I make sure to sell only the best to the Justice League. You'll never get a better deal. Oh. Shut I up. make sure to sell only the best. All right. Let's see if we can find the aquacultural area again. Oh, look at that. My God, we made it. Absolutely amazing. All right. Let's see what the console here has to say. Always nice to pass through the aquacultural area. A little green spot in the midst of this gigantic satellite. This is where we keep Star Labs recalibrating attributes devices, or RADs. Want to refocus your skills to refine your edge? Take a look. All right, so maybe, based on what she said, maybe that's what these are, are the talent reset consoles. Yeah, there it is. It is too. So resetting traits costs 500 bucks and I currently have 3,000. So there you go. That's how much it is to reset your talent points if you really want to. And if you're saying, Sambo, what the hell do you mean by talent points? Um, that's my my way of just saying, hey, it's all this. All your, um, your skill points, your powers, um, your movement. Whoops and things such as these so you just literally reset everything and get a refund so it's pretty cool so it can be done all right back to the map and see where it takes us next turn to the magic wing teleporter eh? all right we're in the meta wing at the moment go through this side door so there you have it Yay. the Justice League watchtower you're now part of a mighty heroic tradition welcome and make us proud I'm sure we'll be talking again soon Oracle out all right so completing that quest not only did I um, finish the quest but we leveled and it says I have a new instance available so let's see what you get at level 14 just out of interest so is it a PvP arena no Oops. Um, is it an alert 
it is it is a new alert and do you know what this one is actually one of my favorites the hive moon base um, definitely one of my favorite um, dungeon finder instances from the beta and presumably still the case um, that's another thing we'll probably cover off on one of the upcoming episodes there's you've already seen area 51 um, you have not seen gorilla island and you certainly haven't seen hive moon base so um, we'll probably make that our next few priorities I'd say so on that note I think we actually I'm not sure if we missed out any of the areas in the watchtower that we probably did um, but um, I'm sure you get the gist of it all it's basically um, your renown and reputation vendors it's your bank it's the auction house well, it, it will be anyway. It's, it's a real honor to help heroes fight crime. It's your Maybe something I have here. You know, it's your respecking area, um, and you know, most importantly, it's it's all the uberlite gear. Um, so your purples and your blues, etc., etc. Um, and finally, of course, at the end of the day, what it actually really serves for is, as I explained earlier, a way to get from um, city to city. Um, via the teleporters here so basically once again if you're in Gotham get to um, the watchtower if you want to get to Metropolis it's that simple uh, you can also use it to actually um, teleport across the same city as well just to different police stations very fast so um, I hope that was enjoyable not too painful in terms of me getting lost I'm sure you will get lost as well <laughs> let me know in the comments if you um, if you have as a frustrating time as I do getting around the place uh, and like I said next time we'll concentrate on some of the new instances that have opened up so I hope you're having a great day so from blaze purple and Sambo it's goodbye until next time see ya